Oh my fucking god, mate! Are you having a laugh, mate? Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Casper's Eye. How the devil are you, mate? We have got a freaky deaky video for you today, absolutely lootly. Alright, this is called 10 Scary Videos to Make You Question the Real World. Okay, this is from Sam Boxton. Make sure you go over to the channel, mate. Subscribe. Alright, sh share the love. Okay, that's pretty much the intro. Alright, so without further ado, our diddly day. Oh, by the way, before we get into it, this is not the end, end of the intro. Remember, we've got a giveaway. Got a giveaway? Go see my other video, and I'll, I'll leave the link, and you can, you can check it out, alright? I gave it a massive giveaway, mate. Anyway, without further ado, our diddly day. Let's do this. Shh. What do you consider to be scary? In this video, we are going to explore that question and present you with a variety of captures that'll make you disturbed and unsure about the world around us. From strange creatures that might be lurking nearer than we think, to something trying to get yeah. inside that really shouldn't. Uh. Let's begin. Yeah. Turn freaky 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 deep. Number 10. Not Michael. Short and straight to the point. Have you ever thought you heard a friend or loved one come home only to realize that you were mistaken? This video plays on the fear of what exactly might be waiting for you, hiding around the corner. Oh, I want to see it, mate. Something that you truly are better off not meeting up with face to face. Hey, Michael, is that you? Fucking hell, what? Not Michael. In a moment that will now linger on in infamy. The face. Look at the bum bags on that horse hound. <laughs> yeah, he must work out. <laughs> Famous last words in a simple what? question. What, mate? Okay, that that is. Michael, is that you? Yeah, that's not Michael. <laughs> hey, Michael, is that you? Oh, mate. Not Michael. Number nine. What makes you truly afraid? Now this next video might help you with that answer. Pay attention to the center of the screen. Something jumps across the line of sight whoa, of the camera whoa, lens whoa, whoa. and it would seem that at the time no one noticed it. Another blink and you will miss its moments. We can't see for sure what exactly that was. Perhaps it was a shadow person or some kind of similar entity. Uh, what, what, what the hell, mate? What is that? What the hell? I was trying to look at this. I was trying to look at this um, uh, fly down here. There's a fly. See down here. Yeah, you can see it. Right, there's a fly, and I wanted to see if it moves away when the shadow person, when the shadow person comes comes p past. Look, check this out. Is the fly? It disappears. We replayed the video many times and tried to break it down to determine what exactly that was. However, it still couldn't be determined. It goes through the gla it goes through the plastic here as well, doesn't it? Determined. Freaky mate. Number eight. A photo submitted by a viewer of the channel. They claim to hear noises at night and feel someone looking at them from time to time. The activity has gotten so bad that they have started sleeping on the sofa in the living room what? where the activity is the least. That is, until one morning when they woke up to breathing on their neck and a feeling of being touched by cold fingers on their face. This however was impossible as they lived alone. In a panic, they grabbed their phone to check the time when the picture was taken by accident. To his no utter shock way. and disbelief, a figure was seen in the image when reviewed later. Looking at it, we can see what appears to be the outline of a tall man in the shadow of the light coming in from the outside window. 
The more concerning part is that he lives on the third floor of an apartment building. There is no way to enter or exit through that or any other windows on the floor to the streets below. What? How do you explain this? I don't know, was mate. Was that an intruder or was it something more insidious? Number seven. This is funny and scary at exactly the same time. He has an encounter that no one expected. See, come and go there and look. Oh my fucking god, See. mate! Wait, where was the funniness? Come and go there and look. Fluck, fleh, leer! Like, where, where was the, where was the funniness in that? Number six. They thought no one else was around, but they can't seem to explain the thing on the right in the water. When asked, his cousin said, I don't know, but I wanted to leave because I felt something was watching us. Sorry, what am I looking at? What, 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 what am I looking at, mate? What in the water? They thought no one else was around, but they can't seem to explain the thing on the right in the water. Oh my god, I can see it now! What the shit? When asked, his cousin said, I don't know, but I wanted to leave because I felt something was watching us. Are you having a laugh, mate? Holy moly! Number five. Captured in the skies over Sydney, Australia, a flying S was seen hovering across the horizon. It's a massive quaver. What do you think? A UFO or something more? It's a fucking balloon, mate. It's a bloody balloon. <gasps> Ordinary. It's a bloody balloon. Mate, you off your head. It's a bloody balloon, man. It's clearly a balloon. It's like a UFO. What the f- It's a balloon! A five. It's not an S. It's a five or an S. Backwards five. <laughs> it's flying. <laughs> flying saucer. <laughs> S the saucer. Oh my god! It's either that or it's a pigeon. Many theories exist as to what that could be. Some saying- It's a fucking balloon, mate! It's an S-shaped UFO craft. To others saying that it's simply a balloon being carried away on the wind. No, really? Really? <laughs> oh God! Reports are that even local authorities were reports. Look, <laughs> mayday, mayday. We got a, we got a two one three. We got a two one three. We may have a UFO, aka an S balloon, over called in to investigate but by the time they arrived it had already disappeared with no further sightings go 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 where's where's the sighting where's the sighting upstairs right i can see it i can see it it's a balloon take it down take it down go go mission accomplished stay frosty number four some stories are too strange to believe for example in 1980, a logger came across this grizzly and somewhat solemn sight when he was processing a log and found the fossilized remains of a hunting dog inside. It seems the dog must have climbed into a cavity chasing a squirrel where it became trapped and a chimney effect occurred permanently preserving the creature in suspended animation for more than 30 years. Oh no! Oh, oh, wow, man, what, how, what a death that would be, just stuck there, until you go hungry. Oh, that's terrible. The final effect is somewhat captivating, terrifying, and heartbreaking, all at the same time. 
Number three, what is the scariest thing that you can imagine coming face to face with in your basement? If I can in the grudge, mate. Or the ring. Knowing that something was down there, would you still enter? It's a bomb's little basement. Oh, mate. It's freaking weird. Oh, oh my god! god! Fucking hell, man! We see in the video that she decided to venture down to the creepy basement alone. Then this happened. Shared to TikTok, she claims this wasn't staged and no one can explain what caused this to happen. What? Number two. With the title, My Room Is Getting Worse and video of an unknown entity opening my closet door for me, the YouTube channel Chris Drake's original channel is no stranger to sharing his encounters with the paranormal happenings in his home with the internet. In a series of recent update videos, we get a glimpse of some of the ghost activity that he is faced with. Bloody disco ghost. Was that a little skeleton hanging up there on the left hand side of the door? People say they wanted me to show you the whole door. Was that, was that an effing orb? Was that an effing orb there as clear as day flashing towards him then? Show you the whole door and I think that was too do solid. the same thing I did last time. I'm just going to ask it. I'm just gonna ask it to open the door. Nothing hard. Okay? It's done. Oh, well. If there's anybody in this room with me, could you open that door for me, please? It'd be really nice if someone could open that door. Hmm. It usually does it by now. I wonder what the heck was that about. Gypsy, what are you doing? <laughs> hmm. There it goes. Told you guys. Nah. Nah. I'm sorry, mate. I'm sorry, that, that's just, that's one of those doors that does it. It's probably, the house is probably starting to sink. And the, 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 the catch on the frame is so loose. I mean, you could hear it. You, it didn't even, it, it's probably hanging on. Like, there's the hole. There's the, it's probably hanging on for dear life, right? And like, you, you do, you get sort of, um, and I think I just read a comment. Some of you said like, um, even firemen would know, you have negative and positive like um, pressure in a house. And it's either that, and it, it just sort of like, it, 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 all it needs is a little bit of a, a budge. And because of the door, it's probably on the, on the piss, it just opens up. It's nothing, mate. It's nothing. And you, you could do that a hundred times. Like every thirty seconds, that probably happens. That that door does not close properly. Properly, pro properly. Period. I told you. I told you. Now. Now say close it. Oops, drop some. There we go. Okay. See, nothing's in here. No one is in this room at all. Not one bit. Dude, your house is on the piss. Sorry. There's no freaky deakiness. No string. No string. Not on the door Push at the all. Look how, look how weak no ass. Push, Push the thing! Look how weak ass that thing is! You. Why? I did this again. Look at this. I've blocked this door off so it wouldn't bother me no more. And it tore up my carpet. It clawed on my door. 
I'm freaking out. Okay. Uh. Okay. Um. I'll get back to you on that one. If there's somebody in here, close the door. Number one. In our last video on the list, we have a fleet of UFOs captured hovering over a city in the region of northern France. Despite the beautiful sight of the blue morning sky, the ominous nature of the large number of objects silently hovering above in formation is beyond worrisome and a little unsettling, with some saying it might be a good idea to prepare for a coming invasion, would you agree? Pigeons. That is weird though, I'll be honest with you, that is weird.